So the Clippers need front court help. They've said behind Zubak, they've been relying a lot on Moses Brown, who's not a bad player, but they want a more accomplished center. And Sham Sharani is reporting that the Clippers are searching for depth in the front court. We talked about how they're interested in Mike Conley, but they discussed deals that pertain to John Wall in those deals. And if you look around the NBA right now, I do think it's a bit interesting because the players that they could go out and get themselves are, mm, John Wall's an interesting fellow because he's a guy currently, like Ken Birch would be someone that brings to mind, but do you think the Raptors would be interested in trading Ken Birch for John Wall? I don't know. That's where you'd be like, okay, that's got to be a three-team trade. So where could John Wall go? I've suggested that he goes back to the Wizards. I think the Wizards would be a team that would be interested in doing a John Wall deal. And with that being said, how do you do a deal that all these teams would be interested in? Now, for me, my assumption is if you can get yourself a deal along the lines of, hmm, it's a bit difficult because... Rui Hachimura is supposedly someone that the Wizards are like really into. And for the, the Raptors, I, I don't sincerely know if this is a team that like if you did Ken Birch for John Wall straight up, that works. But John Wall doesn't fit the Raptors and I don't think that would be where it goes so you would have john wall traded to the wizards and then you had ken birch to trade it to the clippers and that's really one of the few big men that i think out there that actually fits under their salary that they could trade for another is mason Plumley. but do you think the hornets would want to trade for john wall mason Plumley? like if they have a pick involved that makes sense so i i don't know what's the the best fit here and what's the right answer and that's where i want to hear your guys's thoughts down below if this is, in your opinion, something that they should do, like, let's say, Rui Hachimura to the Raptors, John Wall to the Wizards, Ken Birch to the Clippers. Is that is that the best deal? Or do you go out and you hit up the Hornets and you're like, hey, Hornets, take John Wall and we'll take Mason Plumley. I don't know if specifically that deal straight up would work. We'll try it right here. And yeah, that works. You can trade Mason Plumley straight up for John Wall. Mason Plumley would be perfect for this team. Now, is that going to happen? I don't know. That It's a bit difficult to, to gauge because John Wall is a fantastic player, but the Clippers are clearly a team trying to win now while the Hornets are a team that looks like they're bricking for Vic. So it becomes, again, difficult to gauge who are going to be the guys that you know they're gonna they're gonna attempt the the trade for and that's where i wanted to hear your opinion down below in the comment section if you're a clippers fan what would you guys do and why because i really i don't know what would be the right move here again because it just all seems a bit you know i guess you could say befuddling but i don't know it's a it's a it's an interesting situation they are because they're not a bad team, the Clippers, but the John Wall only suits a certain number of teams. And that's why I think Washington's like to get them as a trade partner. So the Washington trade something to get themselves John Wall wouldn't be that bad of a deal. So let me hear your guys' thoughts down below in the comment section. What would you guys do if you were the Clippers? Again, the other deals out there. Mm, if they want a big man, like you could hit up the Pistons. Again, does John Wall fit there? No. Okay, so John Wall goes to a rebuilding team. That's why you need like a three-team trade for a team. And we know that the Wizards have had interest in John Wall. So that brings up a whole other type of house of cards. So that's definitely where I want to hear your guys' thoughts down below in the comment section. What would you guys do and why? I think this is a deal that could very much benefit you know the Clippers I just think the reason why they're looking to trade John Wall is that not that it's not working out it's just like they were better with a, a different style of play and I don't know if John Wall can suit that style of play nothing against him I think he showed he can still play in the NBA John Wall by the way is averaging over here what John Wall is what are his stats for the season they're 11 and a half points 40 percent 41 percent almost from the field 30 percent from three three rebounds five assists a steal night not bad Really, not bad at all.